Hello, this is Fate Shepherd, the creator of the AnyPose Pose Stand, and I'm here today to give you a brief tutorial on how to save a BVH file out of an AnyPose Pose Stand and upload it into Second Life. Uh, BVH file is the, the native animation format that Second Life uses for importing animations and uh, poses. So here I've got my post handout and I'm going to load a pose that I've already created. Load. And now on the HUD I'm just going to click www.bvh and it's going to offer to open this page. I've got my Second Life set up to open my pages in an external browser so it's going to open in Firefox now there's a problem in that Internet Explorer does not open these files correctly so you'll need to use a different browser uh, Firefox, Safari, anything but Internet Explorer and it'll remind you up here if you do use Internet Explorer you can also use the internal web browser that's built into Second Life if you prefer uh, we've got the web page here. Put our cursor right before the H in hierarchy. Drag all the way to the end. Make sure you get all the way to the end. Edit, copy, or just control C. And now we will open up Notepad. Just paste it into Notepad. And notice we've got the whole file uh, starting with hierarchy. There's no spaces, there's no empty lines before it. And we can also see that we can put our cursor after the last line, so there's a there's an empty line after it. And now we save it. Save as. Uh, we can, let's say, we'll just save it to the desktop. Give it a file name. Oh, let's see, we'll call it Bridge Pose. And we need to finish that with .bvh. That's critical. And also, very important, save as type all files. If we don't select save as type all files, the file name will actually be bridge pose.bvh.txt and you may not see that txt. Alright, save. Okay, we can get rid of all this. And we'll go to upload animation and select desktop here. There's the bridge pose right there. Open. Now we've got a preview here. And we should raise the priority. Priority 4. Uh, there are cases in which you'd use a lower priority, but for now we'll just concentrate on priority 4. It must be set to loop. And if we did use a different hand pose than the built-in default hand pose, we'd want to select that here. But in this case, we're just using the default hand pose. We can do a play just to preview it and make sure it looks right. And upload. Now, we can, well, we can fall off the bridge. We can play our pose. And there it is. That pose could be added to a pose ball, it could be added to the bridge itself. Uh, if this were a vehicle, it could be added to the vehicle. In any case, that is how you get a BVH out of any pose and back into Second Life.